and here we are Tuesday afternoon I just came home this one was waiting by the front door I said do you want to go for a walk and she said woo 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 so uh, here we are I once again walking yeah today today as you can see it was it's quite dreary I don't think I have seen the sun today overcast overcast cloudy but as I said in the previous video it was warm in the morning it was actually like 13 14 degrees Celsius and during the day it was only 12 so yeah plus um, it started to I would not even call it a drizzle I think that you can see uh, it's a little bit darker the pavement is a little bit darker this is a kind of what I harder to crook I have my work shoes on I don't want to walk on the grass yeah not the best day pretty Lizica Pretty. But we have to go for a walk. Yeah, I assume like in 45 minutes when we will come home it will be already dark. So at let's say half um, 4.30 quarter to 5. Yeah, today it's uh, so 14 of November, and this uh, weekend, apparently, this year's bank season, so B A N G, has started. So according to one news article, um, a group of young lads were driving when suddenly an, an, an unknown explosive device went off a 19 year old kid was seriously harmed and apparently the explosion was so strong that it even cracked the front windshield windscreen glass so I assume it was not you know military grade like you know hand grenade because in that case everyone in the car would be dead or at least seriously maimed maimed so I assume uh, they were, well, he was playing around with a very strong firecracker. Okay, we'll be right back. Uh, yeah, evidence collected. So as I was saying, uh, I assume, you know, I'm pretty sure that it was a very strong firecracker. And unfortunately, this kid will... No, until you know the end of his life. Pretty easy. Uh, what irresponsible use of fireworks or pyrotechnical equipment, pyrotechnical material uh, can lead to or will lead. So, yeah, when I was also in elementary school, I also bought, I think, yeah, one time 100. Um, illegal of course firecrackers but those were you know let's say regular one regular ones so they were like this uh, this long and like you know half of centimeters thick 
round green green in color um, yeah they could also do you harm if they would let's say explode in your you know clenched fist or uh, closed fist or let's say by the by the okay ear or eyes but yeah now they are selling such firecrackers you know very strong one and unfortunately you know some people think they know the best and now unfortunately yeah, he has learned the consequences and speaking of consequences i mentioned the croatian ministry of the minister of defense so now more uh, information has been revealed so on friday he had like a party he attended a party uh, they were of course drinking and after a couple of hours so i assume he didn't even sleep the whole night you know so that the alcohol would leave his system uh, he went driving alone as I said uh, to attend a hunt and while driving he was still under the influence he tried to overtake uh, a truck and then head on crashed into a van he was not wearing a seat belt and the other guy also but of course um, minister had a better car and he survived um, he has been already um, they are currently in the process of um, replacing him yeah no politician can survive at least in a democracy if he uh, causes a traffic accident while drinking and when you know the other guy is dead so yeah but i'm still you know surprised that, that he doesn't he doesn't have or didn't have a professional driver you know personal driver yeah okay that's it for today or at least for now pretty lizzy grimo nademo